Hello everyone, this is Lloyd. I want to continuously Firebase with database. Uh, I add more data for thread, right? User image or user ID or today date. So if I add some text right here, it add data to Firebase data. And I make row for thread. It's working good, something like that. And it's real time between client and server. And the button. So you can download this called the link and I recommend you watch the previous video. I will sh show you how to set it. But if you already set everything, you can watch it 347. First of all, you have to download uh, Discord from GitHub. Click this one and download the zip. And open the finder and unzip the file. And one more thing, open the terminal, you have to install POD. So move the directory where the project CD space bar and directory and POD install and enter. And using XC workspace, yeah, you have to use it. And go to the Firebase link and make a new project if you are first time to make the project. The name I made Firebase DB test. No, just Firebase DB. And continue. And continue as well. And make the Google Ad Anal Analytic checkbook. And next, wait a few minutes. It will make your project. Select project and you have to setting something as an iOS project. So click this one and put the project setting and click iOS button in the bottom. And the bundle ID from Xcode right here. So copy and paste it. And register app. And download the config file. It's really important. Download it and add it to Xcode project. We already finished POD install and I already did it. So pass it, pass these things. And make database. Click database button and click database. And next. And select the server location. I just down button. So here we go. And you have to change the permission. It's fail. I will change it to true. And open the Xcode. If there is exist config file, delete it. And add a new config file. Something like that. Okay, let's see the code. I just added a few things to see good for the thread. I made some random array, right? The system image name or color string array for changing image color. And I add more some string, user image, and ID, content, and today date. Firefest DB doesn't have the color, so I, I have to change this string to color type. And some function for adding date, like get today or get random string for user ID. And Swift to date Swift, no, Firefest Swift. It's not too much change than previous project. project. This create data using some date. 
and this is read data. If some change what is, it should make like real time between server and client. And this is low swift. It's very simple. Just image view and text. That's it. And add a row in the list. The data pass the data array pass the data to row and then show this thing to user. That's it. It's really simple. You can download those code in the video and test it. I really recommend you watch previous video first and then watch this again. Subscribe and like please. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.